Lombok is an island in Indonesia, situated to the east of Bali. After a week in Bali, our G-Adventures trip continued to Lombok for a further week on this lovely island. Firstly though, we had to get there, and this involved a short drive from Kandidasar in Bali to the Padang Bai port, and then a ferry to Lembar, the main ferry terminal on Lombok. The weather had turned sunny, and the sea was pretty calm, so it was a good crossing. Driving south from the ferry terminal on Lombok took us to our first stop, a traditional Sasak village. The Sasak people are the main ethnic group on Lombok, and in the village, after taking a few photos, we watched a show of their traditional music and then a demonstration of stick fighting. Both were impressive, and everyone in our group found it very entertaining. We then had two nights in Kuta, on the south coast of the island, staying in the peaceful and well-manicured Puri Rinjani bungalows. An hour's walk along the coast, it was surfs up at Sega Reef. The next day our group was driven northwards through the island.
we stopped off for a walk through the forest to Benang Stoko and Benang Kelambu waterfalls, where some of the group went swimming in the cold pools. Not me though. We then proceeded through gorgeous countryside on the way to the Tetibatu rice terraces. This part of Lombok is very rural and beautiful. The traffic's light and there's something very special about driving through such lush countryside. Lombok is much well less known than Bali, but it's a lovely laid-back place. At Tete Batu we had lunch and then set off for a walk through the rice terraces with views of the Mount Renjani volcano in the background. In the afternoon we drove to Senjiji on the west coast of Lombok. Then it was time for one of the highlights of the trip, a couple of nights on the Jili Islands just off the northwest coast. It was time to go snorkeling.
It was pretty good snorkeling, and the lunch of massive prawns at a beachside restaurant wasn't bad either. Then, it was back to Jilly Tea. We didn't stay at this place, but I just wanted to show you one of the more upmarket businesses where you can also eat on the main strip of Jelly Tea. This is over on the west side of the island, where it's less busy. It's quite easy to cycle around the island in half an hour or so, and there are excellent places to stop for coffee or drinks. There are no cars on Jilly Tea, but only horse cars. All too soon, it was time to say goodbye to Jilly Tea and catch the ferry back to Bali. But I definitely recommend Lombok if you like gorgeous locations, nice beaches, lovely islands and friendly people without the Bali crowds. <laughs>